What's happening everyone? Gaming for Life here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys a video on all of the level pack 1 um, achievements for the Shazam level pack, part 1. So, let's get to the video. Alright, so, um, talking about the video here, we have our first achievement that we just got revealed, and this is Billy Battison. I choose you as champion. A trophy achievement. Now, to get this one, you're going to need to complete the Savannah, uh, Savannah Escape level. It says, it says um, the name of the level, which is awesome. Now, saying, um, saying that being said, um, I already saw the movie, so this is Dr. Savannah. So, I hope... We get him as a playable character. I mean, we should. You see his, like, wizardy stick right there? Oh, that's not, like, wizard stick. I'm trying to remember what it is. I saw, I saw our early, early premiere of it. Like, to... I was the first person to see it. In the world, basically. Anyways, I hope that... I hope we get to see Dr. Savannah as a playable character, either in Part 1 or Part 2 Love Pack. There's no doubt in mind that he's going to be a playable character because he was the main villain of the the um, movie. Alright, moving on, we have our next trophy achievement, which is I Can't Take Care of Myself. Here we are. Now, to get this one unlocked... Trophy earned of, um, I can't take care of myself is what you have to do is complete Savannah Escape with all um, mini kits unlocked. Next mini kit, or should I say, I mean, that is a mini kit, but next trophy is this one. Oh, you're like a bad guy, right? Complete, completed Savannah Escape after achieving true villain status. Now this next one is going to be really interesting because if you guys haven't seen the movie, which some of you might have not be able to because of how packed the movie was, movie theater was. Anyways, here it is, you guys. This is the two. These, these are two villains of the story as well that worked for Doctor Savannah. Now these are these are the inner demons uh, achievements. Now you get this achievement by play, playing as uh, Dr. Savannah. I mean, wait, let me rephrase that. Um, you get this trophy unlocked, which is called Inner Demons. And you have to, you have to, oh, um, I'm getting confused because it says played the Savannah escape level. So you have to play in Savannah Savannah escape level as pride and gluttony which the one on the left is is pride and the other one is a gluttony and they look really cool you guys really cool look at how detailed they look right there the one on to the right looks like a jelly bean a green lime bean or a jelly bean oh well not a jelly bean but like um a lime bean or maybe like a bean but anyways they still look awesome. I can't wait to tell what see see what they do for their abilities. But I do know one thing for a fact. One thing that the the character on the left, which is Pride, Pride is probably gonna be able to fly since you guys see that he has wings. All right, this is a very very last achievement, and I'm gonna go over it right now. Now, seeing right here, this is awesome. It shows uh, what's his name? Billy Battison as a kid, and then it shows the adult version of Billy Battison. Now, showing that he has a bat, you could probably use a bat to swing and hit people. It since the other Shazam, that's that's um, I believe it's a DC comic version of Shazam. This one's a movie version, so I assume they would have the same thing, similar with the baseball bat, and. As well as that being said, possibly the transformation, as you guys can see right there. Or maybe the transformation might be a little different from this time around. 
Maybe I'll be like um with some fog or something. I don't know if they can give explosive like that, like because that'll be really cool. I mean, that's what I saw when I watched the movie. I'm not gonna spoil anything for you guys, but I mean, that's not really a spoiler. Everyone knows Shazam can turn into a kid and back to adult from just saying his name, Shazam. Anyways, this trophy is called Say My Name. And basically, it's referring to the wizard Shazam, the very first one. And you're saying his name, so that way his power can go through um, Billy Bastion. So now he is the new Shazam, which is awesome. Anyways, what you do for this trophy here to get it unlocked or achievement, you have to, you have to transform into Shazam's movie version of Shazam and free play. So you have to beat the level and then go back in it and then you should be able to get it unlocked. Alright you guys, that's enough of this video. But um, stay tuned for lots of real soon of upcoming LEGO DC Supervillains. I might, I might consider doing more of these. I think I might do two more of these because I got the um, the level uh, Shazam level pack part two. And then we got the Young Justice DLC, which I cannot wait for. And all these are going to be coming out in, in April. I'm not so sure about the Shazam part two pack. I know for sure part one is coming out in April. But who knows, maybe they'll release it on the same... Maybe not the same day, but I mean, maybe they'll release it in the same months. I don't know. So far, the Aquaman DLC they released it on two different two different months. One was in the start of last year, and then one was around January, I believe. Maybe it was like February, or January. I can't remember. Anyways, stay tuned for lots more soon about coming Lego DC, DC Super Villains. And more news updates to come to the channel. And on top of that being said, I will be doing more of these videos here for achievements. Also, I love how I could do these videos because, like, these these achievements, they show, like, a little bit of detail of what we could get for um, characters. Now, I believe in every character pack that we get that are split up, like, in part one and two, we're getting, like, five characters, either five or six. Alright guys, thank you for watching. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you smash the like button down below. Oh man, I already said that. Never mind. I already said my my um ending. Alright. So I will end the video now and I'll see you guys later. Peace and I hope you guys all have a good one. And let me know down in the comments down below. If you guys think I should be doing Fortnite on my channel, just let me know. And I'm going to do my best to do challenges with, maybe I can do it like a live stream and maybe you guys can just join up on me. Just make sure you guys um, give me your PSN, P, PS4 user and I would add you. Also, we can, we can do duels or whatever you guys would like to do. I just play for fun, but I mean, we can, hopefully you guys can help me, um, what, what's the word I'm looking for? <sighs> Win a battle royal. Or help me, like, get past it. Like, sometimes I have a hard time. Certain seasons, I get past and some I don't. It's because, like, uh, people, they kill, they keep killing you. I just wish that they had, like, um, another mode. I don't know what they would call it, but... I just wish they had another mode where everyone's, like, trying to get their achievements done while, like dying because i feel like it makes it hard for me but you know what it's fortnite it's still fun to play like like um leave a like if you guys um like fortnite i know i like fortnite all right so my next two upcoming videos are probably gonna be the other two i don't know if they're gonna be the next ones but i'm just saying what you guys could be looking forward to in a couple of videos from now or maybe the next two which are the other two achievements for the Shazam Part 2 level pack. And then the Young Justice level pack. And I'll see ya.